All right, ladies and gentlemen, this next episode of Diablo's Den, which is episode three for those of you who actually went to schools where you learned how to count, is brought to you by my good friends at Baying Hound Works. You know, anytime I got to make a trek to that pissant town of Buckley Springs, West Virginia, I continue south before going back home to New York. Anytime I got to take a trip to Frederick or Gaithersburg, Maryland, I make a trek over to my pals on Taft Street in Gaithersburg, Maryland. Danny Mutani, you're my boy. This is for you, okay? I love you like a brother. The products that Bay and Hound puts out, second to none, unfiltered, unpasteurized. And you know what? I'm going to add another because they're ungodly good. Now let's talk about what we came to talk about. Why? Because I took an actual request today from a fan. Is it a fan I like? No, because I don't like any of you. To be honest, which is what I always am, I am Donnie Diablo. I am the voice of a reason for Covey Pro. But let me tell you, so Mr. Harry Leroy Fake, this one's for you. All right, you want me to talk about Just In Time versus Big John Green. But first, why don't we play a game, all right? This is an interactive game. So all you people at home, all you fat redneck imbeciles who are sitting on your couch, stuffing your face full of fatty foods, pay attention and see if you can answer even just one of these questions, okay? Are you ready to play the game? Good, because I am. Okay, question number one. What is this? You see it? There's stainless steel. What is it? You know what those are? Those are handcuffs. Oh, but Donnie, what are those handcuffs from? For those of you who are in Gaithersburg, Maryland, you know exactly what those handcuffs are from. Those are the very handcuffs that have Big John Green skin still on them. Look, take a look at these. Take a look. There's still John's skin from where he struggled to get out of those cuffs when I handed him off to just in time. And although Justin was disqualified. Who did the match really go to? Who walked out? Justin, the star of the show, time. Okay, are you ready to play round two? Let's play round two. How about it? Hmm, what is this? What is this? Do you see it? Do you see it now? How about now? Yes, you know what that is. For those of you who either A, watched on TV, or B, were actually in attendance at Gaithersburg, Maryland, you know exactly what that is. That's my belt. Or how about this? How about those of you who had attendance at our last show? Same belt. Same belt. And you know what? You really want to know what? That belt still has the skin of Big John Green on it. It's just in time savagely whipped John Green and tore his flesh from his body. That is the belt that did it. Still hanging off of it. 
fragments of John Green. You know what, John? You're never going to be the same. And that's what I'm talking about tonight. I'm talking about Big John Green against my friend, my best friend in the world, my mentor, Justin Time, the man I owe so much to. Justin is truly a great man, and whether or not you mindless sheep see it or not, it doesn't matter, because I know it, Justin knows it, Buddha knows it. You want to try to bring a rift between the double dragons, it's not going to happen, because you're wanting to say, oh, Buddha's the alpha. You know what? Let me tell you the truth. There's not an alpha. It's an equal partnership, and I'm just as much a part of those dragons as the dragons themselves. Oh, and let's play another game. How about this? How about this? John, do you remember seeing this? Do you remember this? Hmm? Because that is a titanium expandable baton. And where did this come from, John? Why does this have anything to do with me and you? John, if you remember right, last show, Berkeley Springs High School, what did you do? You came over to my table, where I'm sitting there, not bothering anybody at all, with my cool commentator, Chris Bennett, and no Chris is yelling at me. Get out of the way, Donnie. Get out of the way, Donnie. Get out of the way, Donnie. I didn't get out of the way because I really didn't think you were going to do it. But you did. You threw my friend, my mentor, just in time across my very announce table and on top of me. And yeah. I cracked my head on the concrete. Yeah, I was laid up for a week with a freaking concussion, John, because of you. And you really want to know why I got a problem with you, John. You really want to know where this bad blood comes from. I laid up in a hospital for one week because of you and cracking my head on the concrete. Because you threw my friend directly on top of me. Yeah, I jumped up. Yeah, I brandished the baton. But did I have any idea where I was? No. You caught me completely by surprise, John. But rest assured, that is never, ever gonna happen again. I caught you by surprise. You caught me by surprise. You know what, John? We're even. But I never lose. I never ever lose. I don't care what game we're playing. I don't care who we're playing against. John, I have your number. Justin has your number. And I don't care what I have to do, John. I'm going to make sure Justin wins that match. I don't care if I've got to take the punishment for him. I don't care if I catch quitting time. I don't care if you knock me out cold, John, if you choke me out, if you throw me over the rope, if you bust me open, I don't care. I don't. Because all that matters is that the prophecy is fulfilled. All that matters is just in time takes his rightful place. That just in time beats you, John Green. And once that happens, do you think it's going to stop? Do you really think the punishment's going to stop? No, because no matter what condition I am in, John, no matter what condition Justin Time is in, we're still going to come for you. Buddha will come for you. The dragons will devour you, John. It's the end of Big John Green. I said it before, I'll say it again. The green scene is dead, and I swear to anyone's God that I will make that happen.
Justin will make that happen. We have never been more focused. Justin has never been more focused in his life. You have no idea what you're in store for, John Green. No idea. Keep threatening me and see where it gets you. Because while you're focused on me, you're forgetting about the one important thing. And that is the star of the show himself, Justin Time.